Huh, notice the white mineral deposits, kind of like cave popcorn. Look under here. Wow, lots of white under there. Pretty. This is weird. It's a little bit of rough ceiling. Oh shoot, there's a bat. I didn't even see the bat because it was camouflaged. Okay, so that's six bats in here. Whoops. I was looking right at that bat and I didn't see it at first. That's Mr. Blind Man to you. Look how white it is up there. Pretty. So now I'm at the only actual difficult part. I gotta walk out here. And uh, well, I have to be very careful not to slip on this ledge or I'll fall several feet down. That'd be a tragedy, terrible tragedy. All right, cool, I'm alive. It's a miracle. All right, here we go. What's weird, look at this. There's a rock on. The stick underneath that rock. I wonder if somebody put the stick there and then moved the rocks on purpose or what. Kind of seems strange. But, oh well. There's that sign again. The Big Ice Cave. I don't remember who named it. Even though this used to be a tourist cave, there isn't a lot of information. See, the problem is there are a lot of other caves named Big Ice Cave, like one in Montana. So if you go on the internet, search for a big ice cave, you're gonna find lots of information about the wrong cave. So, yeah. Like there's a cave near here named Mammoth Cave, but obviously it's not the Mammoth Cave. So you go on the internet, search for information about Mammoth Cave, well, you're gonna find the wrong Mammoth Cave. So, kind of frustrating, but oh well. So, People act like the internet has everything, but you know, it doesn't just land in your lap on a silver platter. It's still gonna kinda work for it. All right. Now, that's the main part of the cave. There's actually two more entrances ahead. I'm gonna do these in separate videos. It looks like the caves ahead are even harder than this one. So I'm gonna do a piece at a time to keep it manageable. So this concludes the main part of Big Ice Cave.